morning guys, I hope you're all really well. I've totally just realized that I've waved to you with a tampon in my hand. <laughs> Start again. Morning guys, I hope you're all really, really well. I thought I'd do a little bit of another day in the life video today. It's a Wednesday today, which is my normal day off with Harry. It's a day where I pretty much dedicate the whole day to him. Unfortunately this morning though, I have got to go to the dentist, so I'm gonna have to drag him along to that which I don't know if he's going to enjoy <laughs> because I'm really scared of the dentist and I find it really hard to conceal that I'm scared of the dentist. So anyway, yeah, it's just like um, a checkup for my Invisalign and I think they're going to file like between one of my teeth, which is going to be really delightful. Last time they did it to like all my teeth and I cried my eyes out. So I'm really hoping that it's not too bad because it's only on one tooth. So yeah, we're going to pop to Winchester for that in about an hour, and then we're going to go and meet Jesse and Jensen. I think Jasper's at preschool, so we're going to go and meet Jess. Um, if you don't follow Jess, by the way, I'll pop her link below. She's great. She is on a whole massive vegan journey, so she's taking me to an amazing vegan cafe. I am definitely not a vegan. I don't think I ever will be, but I do really enjoy vegan and vegetarian food. I think that it's very delicious, and the menu to this place looks insane. I look absolutely hideous. I've got like a bit of Nutella on my top. So I just had porridge with Nutella in for my breakfast because I'd run out of peanut butter and oh my god It was insane living in my house at the moment quite stressful because there's just like this everywhere boxes Sellotape yeah, we're moving house in like a month, but it's been a bit delayed. So yeah, we're just sort of living with boxes everywhere and It's so stressful <laughs> rushing around getting ready for the dentist so vlogging really shouldn't be happening right now because I am in such a rush um, and because we're going to this vegan cafe I'm gonna have to make like something for Harry to have because it looks all quite fancy vegan -y food and he's super fussy so I'm probably gonna make him a ham sandwich to eat there <laughs> I just wanted to say a quick thank you to everybody who left me some really lovely comments on my last, I don't know if it was my last video, but it was like the last sort of like raw day in the life vlog that I did. I was talking about how I've been suffering from really bad kidney infections and you all had some really nice comments and good tips and all sorts. Um, so this week it's been okay. Luckily I'm still waiting for a urology appointment. I'm not 100% sure whether to use my private healthcare or not for it. Um, I'm just kind of kind of wait and see what happens over the next couple of months. I'm really out of breath today for some reason. This is absolutely nothing to do with kidney infections but I've started taking an iron supplement because I've been feeling a bit low and tired lately and I've always been a little bit low on the iron front. So I've started taking this Floridex. Um, liquid iron and vitamin it tastes gross it tastes really really sweet and um like it tastes a little bit like blood i think which is a bit weird it looks like blood too um but yeah if you tried it let me know if it works i've obviously only taken a little bit i've taken it for like the last 24 hours and i feel no different so um let me know if you think it's good or if you know of a better liquid iron supplement because yeah i just feel like i need to take something a little bit extra to perk me up I am literally, look at all this natural light. I am loving it. It's so sunny today. It's so nice. I don't even think it's that cold. Anyway, I'm going to stop wittering on now because I really need to get in the car. It's like nine o'clock and my appointment is in like an hour. So yeah, I better get going and uh, see you at the dentist. I just got out of my dentist appointment. Sorry if it's really loud. It's a really busy road. Um, yeah, it was, it was horrid. <laughs> it only lasted like 10 minutes, which was good. But um, he had to do like teeth filing in between each of my teeth again, which is just excruciating. Um, I don't know if anyone else has had this done, but I just find it so painful. So yeah, I'm kind of regretting my Invisalign right now. It is such a glorious day today. It feels a little bit, dare I say it, summery. Look who we found. Hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> say hello. hello. Look at your hair. <laughs> This one, sweet. Really cool. Oh. It all sounds amazing. Yeah. 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 Because you like that, baby. We can stop it. Say cheese. 
We just had the absolute. Oh, that's not the right word. <laughs> we just. The absolute most amazing. That's what I was yeah. going to say. Be right. <laughs> we just had the best lunch ever, and it was at this little vegan place. Is it called? What's it called? Um, Offbeat is the cafe. Oh right, okay. <laughs> It's called Offbeat and it was really, really cute. And like Jess was telling me, vegan food doesn't make you feel ridiculously overly full, which is really nice. We had this like gnocchi pesto thing, which I would never have known it was vegan. And it had like this vegan ricotta, which was delicious. And we had this chicken stuff, which was actually called Satan, which I've never heard of before. But anyway, it was really nice. And it's, it's kind of got me a little bit more interested in vegan food, because I must say, I probably wasn't that interested before. So Harry's got tons of energy now. So I think we're just gonna have a little walk because it's really, really nice weather. So we're gonna make the most of the sun. What can you see? Harry? You're such a cool dude, aren't you? Cool outfit. So we're just walking back to find our car now. We've had such a nice day. I don't know if, why I'm in such a good mood today. I don't know if it's that iron supplement. Yeah? Yeah, we're gonna go find our car and then we're gonna go do some food shopping. Yeah? You gonna help me do the food shopping? No. Oh. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna go in the trolley? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we're gonna go and do a bit of food shopping because we're kind of running out of the essentials. <laughs> Even though we get HelloFresh boxes for dinner, I do find that we still need to do a bit of a top up shop for like bits and pieces and lunch things and Harry's food and all sorts. But yeah, it was so nice to catch up with Jesse. And um, yeah, we had like quite a lot of conversation, which was good because obviously that can be quite rare with kids. And the cafe we went to was really cute. And I definitely think it's got me a little bit more interested in vegan food because before, I was like, what can you eat? <laughs> but now I'm like, oh, okay. That was all pretty good. Okay. How many more? Go on then. One more. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know where our car is? No. <laughs> so we just finished our food shopping in Asda. I hate Asda. It drives me absolutely bonkers. But. I just find that they have the best selection of food and I find their fruit and veg really fresh. So yeah, I do really like shopping in Asda as a brand, but Asda is just skanky. And yeah, I just always find that the people that work there are really moody and I just don't really have like a good experience anytime I go to Asda. But anyway, we've got our shopping and Harry, are you ready to go home and chill out? Yeah. <laughs> So we've just got home from Asda and I filmed a grocery haul. I've never, don't think I've ever filmed one before. So I thought I would film a grocery haul. So I'm not really sure what order it's gonna go up in, if this is gonna go first or that might go up first. I'm not sure, but if you're interested in seeing what I got from Asda, then um, yeah, go and watch that video. Yeah, so I've got home. I've got to put all the shopping away and then I'm going to sit down with a nice cup of tea and enjoy this delicious vegan brownie that I bought on our travels with Jess. If you're wondering why I've changed my outfit into this horrendously chabby hoodie, it's because Harry peed himself in the car and I had to pick him up and bring him in the house and that resulted in a big pee stain on my own top. So I'm in my comfies now. I've also got to put like a bunch of washing on. But yeah, I think I'm gonna sit down with my cake and just sort of sit and PMS to myself on the sofa. Finally sat down with my cup of tea and my vegan brownie, which is absolutely insane. I would have no idea that this is like dairy free and whatever else it is free because I'm not 100% sure what vegans eat and don't eat, but it's amazing. So anyway, I'm just sat down with my cup of tea on my sofa with my laptop and I opened my Instagram and somebody had messaged me about anxiety. Um, I did a little bit of a post the other day on Instagram. It was completely impromptu because I was having a really bad anxiety day just for absolutely no reason. I don't suffer horrendously with anxiety, but I have done um, quite badly. And I guess it's something that you are always living with if you do have a sort of anxious mind if you like um so yeah i feel like it's something you always have and you just have a bad day every now and again and i had a bad day and when i talked about it on instagram i popped in my stories a link to the channel mum website and the fact that they have a 
not only some really good YouTube videos for anxiety and helping you to be a bit more calm and some mindfulness, but they've also started a bit of a support group online and I just wanted to talk to you about it today because I think it's amazing. I used to be a bit of a forum geek, like I would be on forums for everything and it was mainly about playing The Sims. <laughs> because I was like so addicted to The Sims and I just wanted to talk about it and get like the best cheats and stuff. So yeah, I was a little bit addicted to forums, but now in my adult non-Sims life, my real world, I actually find forums really amazing. You've got like so many different links for different things. So this is the mental health group. There's one for baby chat, like if you've just had a new baby or pregnancy support, or there's even like things about like vlogging and stuff like that, which is really handy. But Anyway, you can see here that somebody started a thread trauma group for PTSD, someone's pregnant with PTSD, um, a couple of people have written about having a rough day. So yeah, you've got all these different threads here that you can either read and sort of take away and put into your life or you could reply on and try and help somebody. I just thought it was worth mentioning because the person who just insta messaged me asked me for the link to the website and the link to the videos that channel mom have done on anxiety so I just wanted to tell you about that in case you are struggling with your mental health or even if you're not struggling and you just want to sort of like talk about your baby or being a parent or something like that then go and check out the website check out the forum or the support group I think they're calling it um yeah it might be something that you find really helpful Oh, I won because I got your stone. One nil, daddy. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, I won because I cut your paper. It's the end of another day and another vlog. I thought I would sign off here as uh, the rest is just going to be boring. I'm about to jump in the bath. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. I'd love to have you here. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.